As Jason's alluded to, is it back from New Zealand? So I wish to see how he goes. First run back here up in Australia again. Green light, Lua travels. This is the Masters race nine, the second last. We're all set, ready. Racing Cumbria Jim got away well with Cumbria Lad and Tilly's vision now going through the lead. Manila Beef is wide with sure she is tight into the first quarter. Tilly's vision holds the lead only just Cumbria Jim's getting the inside. Manila Beef caught wide out the back. Bigger star sure she is handbrake but in the straight. Cumbria Jim in front of Cumbria Lad and Cumbria Jim big Cumbria Lad. Manila Beef third. They were followed by Bigger Star. Sure she is further back in the field then was Tilly's vision and it was one of the last in with handbrake the time around 17.10. Gee, they got very compact out of the first corner behind the bolt up Tilly's vision and Cumbria Jim handling himself beautifully railing home the score by Barcia Bale out of Hilltop Babe, Stephen Fish the owner trainer. Number two Cumbria Lad, the kennel mate second and eight Manila Beef, Jeff Sheva third, number four ha Bigger Star fourth, one two eight four, one and a quarter by one and three quarters. 5.33 early, 17.16 is the overall time. 11.83 is the run home. So the box certainly won it for Cumbria Jim. Looked like there was going to be all sorts of trouble out of that first quarter, but he held the fence, got underneath the bolt until his vision. That's got him home. Cumbria lads tracked him home on the inside. And Manila Beef, he was really never on the track. He was in an awkward place for most of the way. But once again, he ran an honest race for third. One, two, eight, four after race number nine. Roger just standing by for the all clear. One, two, eight, four. It takes us into the last race 10. The final event, take out number five. Number five comes out. I mean, is Marika and a field of five to run in the last. Due at 10.17. All clear on race nine. 